How's it going, everybody? This is Rugged Elf. And uh, tonight I'm still working on my fourth expedition. I am trying to find the archive override implant ocean components that I am looking for. So I landed on a water planet. This is the same system that um that I have my mining colony on. So well, I got lucky with that. So maybe I can see what I can find out. So come down here. Let's hope not too many jellyfish try to eat me. Got him. That's all I need. Oh, we got that one. So now let's look for the hard part. Let's get some air. Oh, I can breathe again. Hooray. All right, so let's take a look. See what's going on here. And we tag you. Fly. I fly better in the water than I do in the air. So... Okay, I can breathe. Alright, got one. All I need is two more. If this is going to be this easy. Dig. Dig a big hole. Oh my goodness. I don't even know. I ought to go to Vegas. This. Where are you? Uh, I'm not digging 127, you underneath the water. Oh no. Alright, let's go over here. That is going to kill me for sure. How about over here? Anything good? There we go. Give me in a deep ocean, I'll take it. I start digging them holes too deep, you know where it's going to end up, right? Oh, right here. Do I have it? Excellent. Hey. I couldn't ask for anything better. So, maybe since that went so quick, maybe I'll go up to the space station, spend a little bit of navigation data to see if I can find that massive archive terminal. Let's see if I can get this all knocked out at one time. And then I'll only have three videos left to do. And that'll be the three last rendezvous points I gotta go to. Three, four, and five. And kill the associating worms along with it. But. And that should be it. For this expedition. And I cannot wait for to get this done. I'm currently playing this game on the Xbox on my PC. And I am just very disappointed in how it's running. So I also got a um, Steam account set up with the No Man's Sky. So continuing videos that I'm getting out of this is going to be done on there. So 
I've had how many years I've been playing this thing and I still have no idea what the buttons are but I got the stuff I need I'm on my way up to the space station and we're gonna see if I can get my little nav data so I can get this out of here all right so here we go off to the station we go hooray boom all right so we're coming up on a space station here now, I've actually heard a couple people saying that they got one planetary chart and got it right away. Others said they took them five or six times to do it. So I want to grab one of them and I want to see how, where, it, um, whether it gives me what I'm looking for. And I'm looking for a planetary archive. Uh, if you're nice to me. How do you do, sir? I would like to buy a couple charts off of you. Yes. Yes, I do have a specific chart in mind. Um, actually, uh, commercial. I'll get two of them. All right. So. Let's try something here. Head out. Make a save. Come in here and I'll blow off a chart. Minor settlement. Alright. So, let me see if this works for me. I got plenty of navigation data that I can buy planetary charts. I just testing out some other people's theories. Okay, and we're back after this commercial break what we need to do right now guys is cross your fingers because the third time is a charm and what I do with that planetary data huh, okay so yeah just kidding here it is well, another observatory all right, so now let's go back to this one again. Oh, minor settlement. All right, you're going to be a putt egg. Uh, let's go grab a few more. I figure when all said and done, we can go check these other places out. Oh, be nice to me. Planetary Archive! Yay! Go figure. Maybe I didn't buy enough of them. So, here we go. Let's go find this Planetary Archive. See what we're doing. Alright, where are you? Alright, now I got all these markers all over the place. <laughs> that wasn't very smart, was it? Okay, there's my observatory. Colossal Archive and I guess Minor Settlement. We're going to the Archive. <sighs> oh, what are you doing? Oh, I'm out of gas. That figures. Alright, Public of Service announcement, guys. Always check your gas gauge. You don't want to go on long trips with an empty tank. You end up running into a rock like I did. Oh, here you are. Where can I park? Oh, thank you. Right in the front row. Yeah, he's right in the front row. I'll take it. Just don't point me toward that damn front of that building. I always hit them things when they make me point at them. Ooh. 
A nice little hot rain. What? And I have to shoot my way in the archive. Yeah. What more? This is crazy. I've never seen this before. Okay. Hey, finally let me ahead. Let me clean you out a little bit. Make it look a little neater for you. Dang, this thing has must not have been visited for eons. Okay, so let's get this thing. Kovitsky Entity. No, I ain't even going to try to do this. So, Korvac. Okay, Korvac Archive is intended only for this own species. Ancient audio equipment drones, low frequency, seemingly expecting a voice command. Access bound archives. Archive implant installed. Kabam! Lock document requested. Override successful. Warning! Significant cognito hazard detected. Biological entity should proceed with extreme caution. Accessing. Now, if you guys did the. Uh, when you finish up each of the stages of the expedition, you'll get a little. Uh, I forget what they call it. Uh, the little lore page that you get. And. This is actually all the lore from the lore pages all together. We heard them before we saw them. Felt them before we heard them. The children were the first to notice, running home with tales of earth moving under their toes. The thump, 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 thundering deep below the sand. I doubted. We all did. Until the day of the great storm. As the first heavy raindrops hit the dust, the rumbling deepened. Everyone heard it. Something huge was shifting beneath the surface of the planet. See, cried our children in brief triumph, before hiding fearful faces, we're all afraid. But when the first worm breached the surface, we couldn't look away. It was breathtaking. So colossal was the beast that it cast our whole settlement into darkness, splitting the sky like black lightning as it limped overhead. Worm by worm, they rose from the desert, a few at first, then dozens, bursting from the ground and diving back below, migrating. The ingestion cycle has been tradition for as long as anyone can remember. There are no requirements to become a sacrifice. No restrictions of status or age. We are all equal under the Great Worm. Anyone may enter the Mall. Every storm season, we each hope to be chosen. We arrange ourselves in lines across the desert, arms lifted to the sky. I don't want to be eaten by a worm. I don't know about you guys. Especially if you've seen some of them. They got some big teeth on them. So. We got that finished. There. Yeah. Thank you for allowing me to clear out your archive for you. So everybody else can come visit. Yeah. That was very nice. Hey, look. The storm passed. Now what? Did my ship get buried under the rock now? Of course. Alright. So. We got that taken care of. And so I hope that you all are going to enjoy this video. If you like this video, if you please hit the like button and then um, possibly subscribe. I do plan on having some more contact co content coming out soon. So until then, I bid you adieu. I will see all of you on my next video. Thanks.